Kwesi and Amina are entrepreneurs who want to build and grow their business. An important first step in their journey was to understand and apply the key building blocks of the business model canvas. Through the dynamic Gender Makes Business Sense GMBS training, Kwesi and Amina looked at their business through a gender transformative lens for the first time. This helped them identify new ways of doing business. Kwesi's business, for example, sells delicious coconut snacks. Raw coconuts are thinly grated, coated in honey, and then sold as packaged sweet treats. One of Kwesi's key activities is the loading of raw coconuts for processing. Kwesi noticed that only men carry out this activity. The men load huge bags filled with coconuts every day. Women cannot do this was the common explanation. But through the gender transformative approach, Kwesi came up with an idea. What if we added the use of smaller bags with a 20 kg limit for the coconut loading? This way, more women can be employed in loading and all employees benefit from a less straining loading option. Amina, on the other hand, designed digital stickers that are specific to a country, from gestures, clothing to food. She is now looking for partners to develop an app to make the emojis available on smartphones. When Amina started looking for partnerships and funding, she realized that the tech sector is dominated by men. Thanks to GMBS, Amina is now thinking about this strategically to make the right business moves. Not only does she need to push her idea, she needs to push for her place in the sector. Using the Visual Business Model Canvas tool with an added gender dimension allowed Kwesi and Amina to map out their business development plan and set themselves up for success.